Welcome back to Apex Alchemy. Today we have a, uh, a special kind of unboxing. Uh, it's uh, one of our subscribers and family members, my, my brother-in-law, uh, dropped off a box plus a couple of fixed plates. I know of a couple of things that's going to be in this box because he told me he was going to put them in there. I don't know what else is in there. Not entirely sure what's We've going on. We've got surprises. We do have surprises. Uh, first of all, we got this cold steel. Let me open it like that. Oh, yeah, let me pull it out like that. Okay. He said he said this is one of his primary users. SR6? SRK. Okay. Got, got uh, some expanding foam on here. He told me this story about that. Okay. Um, so that's one of the fixed blades. Oh, he's getting that one back in. Got a cold steel. AK-47. I like that one. I like it. It fits really good in the hand. All right, I'm going to pause the video for a second. We're going to open, open the, box the box and get rid of the box. Yeah, I'm like, just going to show you. We got, a, we got a, a box full of stuff. But I'm going to pause it and grab it all out. Okay. Well, we got them all out of the box. <clears throat> so we got uh, like 13 knives here. Got a lot of stuff, yeah. you know, to, to go through. Um, Where's that other? Strider? Oh, there's that other fixed blade. Okay, I was going to say, where'd it go? So the Strider SMG. I like the back of it. It's very light. It's like light, it's lighter than I thought they would be. This is the first time <laughs> I've first time I've handled a Strider, you know, to be honest. And I'm uh I'm impressed with the weight. You know, like I'm not a real big fan of how they look, but I haven't used one so. Uh, man, you know, it's one of those things, you mm -hmm. know, it's, uh, it's, I could see how the style of this knife would be very polarizing. and I happen to like it, but, um, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely do a full video on that. This little filler. Azula, S.E. Rowan Azula. Yep. I'm not a, a I'm not a big fan of Essie putting bugs on all their blades, but <laughs> well, that might just be their thing. Might to... <laughs> I don't like them. <laughs> you might be, to... but I like this little little fixed blade here. Yeah, it's a, it's it's a neck knife. Yeah, you know, and yeah, it was... it's little and easy to carry. That's right. We've got a Spartan Blades. Um, that's a Les George design. I believe this is called the Aster. I may be wrong. You know, like I'll I'm, have to look look some stuff. Yeah, up. I'll have to I'll have to look a few things up. You know, and and yeah, it's that's not a big deal. But you know, like I don't know all the details just yet. These aren't mine, so uh, just bear with me. When we do full videos, we'll have all the information or all the information we can find. Here we go, y'all. <laughs> oh, it's a mass drop knife. Uh, man, I've seen this symbol before. I feel like I should know what that symbol means, and it may be. It just says man. Oh, you talking about right there? Yeah, I, I, I want to say. I think it's this right, the same thing right here. Yeah, it just says design. It's like Ferrum it. Forge. I'm I'm a, I'm ninety I'm ninety five percent sure that that's Ferrum Forge, like a it's like a FF. But I like this I like this blade. It looks very utilitarian. I don't know anything about the knife. We'll do a full video on it as well. Um, what else we got? Okay. Okay, this is that, uh, yeah, it's tight. Um, it's the DXT. The DPX. DPX, yeah. C-A-R-R -R or something like that. And, uh. Hest. Yeah, H-E-S-T. Then we got a R something P over here. I think that's, uh, Robert Platon. I'll, I'll get my details together. I'm uh I'm not familiar with this knife at all. I know it's got a bottle opener, or a jeans catcher. I think it'd be used for both. I'm not sure what kind of steel it's in, but we'll we'll it, you know it's a titanium frame lock for sure. It's got a good lock up. It's tight, like it's. He, he uh, told me I think this is the one who was telling me he had to lock the pivot up to. Yeah, I guess it kept on getting loose on him or something. I, got I can't that. remember, but he says he used, like he used the hell out of it. So um, I don't tell him how many years. We got an Emerson. And uh, this one's the sheepdog. I hope I'm getting things in the camera, y'all. 
kind of writing on this side of this. It's kind of kind of real light there. Yeah, it is. Maybe. It helps me. Yeah, that's okay. Well, we'll do a we'll do a full video on it as well. We'll do a full video on all of them because I'm. Haven't done this one yet. Yeah, well, I like this one. I can't remember what it's called. I think it's got three initials. It's a Strider fixed blade of of some sort. It was like a R O C or R O K or or something like that. And somebody out there is probably you know like shaking their head because I'm an idiot. <laughs> but I, I've never owned one. I, I've got a I've got to look all this information up. But it's it's in three V. Very very nice feeling fixed blade. I like it's got good balance and all that stuff. What is this monster? I have no idea. That's a bridger. <laughs> it's got a lion with the crown on his head. What? I was just curious. <laughs> chisel blade type of thing. Or chisel tip type of thing. I don't have a clue. I'm lost. I'll have, I may have to ask him about this one just so I can have enough information to... To get started. To get started with it, yeah. <laughs> but I like it. It's it's a uh, big and I mean it's not it's not huge but it's uh it's got some weight it does have it's, some heft it's thick and and yeah it does have some heft what have we skipped okay so this is uh this a Boker lateralis I remember when this thing came out I was like kind of has the Strider back look to me that funk I I mean yeah no I it's, mean I, it's opposite I get no, what you're saying it, it's it's going the same direction. It's just that's what it looks like. It's like what's di what's directional? Well, I was thinking. Oh, that, yeah. oh, 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 like this whole this whole yeah. thing here looks about the same. They they make some in like a uh, titanium scales that have these like bars coming through them. So that's what I thought you were talking about. But yeah, that, just the whole whole look of it. That's a stout design. I can't remember that dude's first name. He told me. Ooh. <laughs> All right. We have a, uh, it's a ZT0630, and that could possibly be one of the best ZTs ever made. Like I love that. That's yeah, it's got. He said that the he was pretty sure that USA is the company that did the anodization on that, and it did turn out very well. Hmm. Like splotchy type of anodization. Mm -hmm. Serial number two thousand or twenty two twenty two oh two. S thirty five N still we'll do a full video Pretty on that. Quick. Love the scale. Mm -hmm. It reminds Feels me of good. that sovereign that yeah. I had at one point. Like uh, it, it just it's nice and grippy and it feels good. What have we not went over? The, yeah. Oh, ah, Lord, have mercy! You no. pulled a cord. Me. I have to re-record this so <laughs> Alan, Alan doesn't see me uh, drop his knife. Let's see what we got here. It, it's a Microtech. I believe this is an Ultra Tech. What? Oh my. Um, Boba Fat? Maybe it's like. Don't ask it's me. Like, maybe not. Maybe not. But I'll I'll check it out. I, what is that? Like a window breaker or something? Yeah, kind of like a window breaker or skull crush, crusher or, <laughs> or something to that extent. It's got a stiff trigger. He's used this knife. I like the colors on it. It's like different. It, just, it is different. Yeah. We'll do a full review on that one too. We just need to figure out. We got some information to find out. But uh, it's a pleasant surprise. that. Uh, well, we have some content headed yeah. your way. Oh, and by the way, if you're still watching the video at this point, uh, the Viper. Uh, I guess we might as well show you. Viper I mean, Storm. The Viper Storm come in. This is, uh, this is the giveaway knife that we're giving away on our channel. Um uh, February the 17th for any subscriber that has completed the game uh, the game starts at the video I want to play a game it's carbon fiber it's M390 that thing has some good action it sure does it's a little smaller than I thought but it's it, uh, yeah no I mean it's it's not a bad size or anything but it's just uh and like this modular system this comes out like all you gotta do is like take this take this one screw out and that comes off and you can replace it with all kinds of different things. I like right now it's got like some lot lanyard hole. I think that can be doubled as a glass breaker. Gotcha. But it's uh 
It's a Hinder design and it came in the mail today. It's got that nice. We won't use it or anything. Nice sound to it. We'll just we'll do a we'll do a review on it. Uh and and then we'll Pretty put good. it up. And when the twenty uh the seventeenth comes around in February, we'll give it away to one lucky winner. You may end up having to give me one. I, I was thinking the same thing, but honestly, <laughs> I was like, just a second, man. I think, I think I'll hold my money myself for a full track. Like, uh, they're they're out of they're out of production, mm -hmm. and uh, they're they're harder to find. But I think I, I, I like the the idea of the the eight inch knife okay. uh, for my hands better. I think but, I like it just fine. But there's nothing wrong with that. It's a nice. It's, it's for for what it is, it's it's an Italian made knife. It's not a USA, but like you see what's going on here, like, I, all right. So, uh, in essence, this is a frame lock, and then it's got carbon fiber overlays mm -hmm. over the frame. But you know, it's going to be called a liner lock. Yeah. Because because of the way it's constructed. But it's not actually different pieces. No, it's not different pieces. It's actually part of the frame. And I've seen this on a couple of different things that they actually just consider a, 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 a liner lock. lock, and that's and that's cool, you know, like call it whatever you want to call it. But that's a that's a thick liner, you know. Like anybody that's watching these videos probably knows it's you know that's a that's a titanium liner, <laughs> but yeah. it's advertised as being on a titanium frame, right? So it's, it's a titanium frame, carbon fiber overlays, but they're going to consider this this a liner lock, which is eh, there's nothing wrong with that. Well, I like the multiple deployment options on it. You got the flipper and thumb studs, and both of them work very well. You know, like, I, I haven't tried to push button it yet, but it does fine. I think that looked like a light switch, but I was pushing in. Yeah, okay. Right. Push button is just fine. Light switch is just, just fine. Thumb studs just fine. Multiple deployment options. It does have the little... Filler. Yeah, it's yeah, got the filler tabs. Uh, the this that's a hinder. That's a hinder yeah. thing, okay. and this is a hinder knife. And it's got the horse <laughs> on it, on the back, which is kind of cool because like you don't. You don't yeah. see it very often. No, you don't. See, I mean, you don't see it on production hinders. You know, like you see it on hinder hinders. Uh, but we'll get more information about this knife. Uh, we'll definitely do a, a full review on it and later on tonight or something. Don't know what order everything's gonna be coming in. Yeah, y'all. He got he got a now for his birthday. Satu Dave is sending sent him some stuff right at his birthday, and today he gets this. Yeah, man. So happy birthday, Billy. Well, thank you, thank you. But uh, yeah, and I gotta get Satu Dave's stuff back to him. It's like I've uh, I screwed the whole day off trying to find a, a FedEx. <laughs> But I guess we can cut the video now. Yeah, I can. <laughs> but if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Uh, get in on this game. You know, we would we would love to see uh, a, a lot of participation and you know uh, and, and share with your friends. You know, I mean, it's a it's a two hundred fifty dollar knife. We'd like to. We're going to give it away. You know, regardless, on February seventeenth, somebody's going to win it. But we'd like to. It'd be, like it'd to be, have some competition. It would be nice to have some competition. I think we got five or six com that have completed, that have completed yeah. it so far. And uh, and that's fine, you know. Like, but it would be much more enjoyable, I think, to have more uh, more more participation. Yeah, it's not hard, you know. I'm At like, all. There's one video. It's got three three eggs. And three video. eggs, and that yeah, like that's a that's all I'm gonna give you. So all you gotta do is find seven, and those those seven aren't that hard either. So anyway. We'll get some. Uh, we'll get some. We'll get some information written down, and we'll check everything out. Do we go over everything? Yeah, oh, I think we okay. got every one of them. Excellent. All right. Well, you guys have a great rest of your evening. This will not be the last you hear from us, and we'll catch you on the flip side. Later.